Hello everybody and welcome to Mark Goldbridge, Manchester United, uh, career mode on FIFA episode 14 and it's the big one. It's a big one. It's the uh, Europa League semi-final stream. Uh, we're going to be playing Get Off A. Get Off Me, Get Off A, Get Off Me. The joke still works. I hope you're all doing well this uh, Tuesday afternoon. I'm excited. I'm excited. I really am enjoying this career mode anyway. Um, and I hope many of you are as well. But I am really enjoying this uh, career mode. And um, But this is the time, isn't it? I really do enjoy it. And then you get, um, you get to the business end. And hopefully we can get this done. So we've got... Um, we, look, Getafe in the Europa League is a very exciting game. But it's not just about that. We're in a massive, massive fight here with five games to go for what was our objective, which was to get Champions League football in season one. And we've had our ups and downs, but we're there in fourth place. We've got thir we played 33 games, got 67 points. This is the game in hand against Spurs. So Chelsea played a game more, more than us. Wolves have played a game more than us. They're only a point behind. So this is about breathing space against Wolves by beating them, uh, which is going to be... Uh, rather interesting i think so uh, let's see how we uh, get on with that um please do read comments whilst the other team's got the ball it costs you says mark mccall um key dear k deary wants me i don't know what let me just do this before i forget um just, just, do, just do it in England. That's that's fine by me. Right, let's get on with this. Play match against Spurs. <sighs> away to Spurs. Of course we're away to Spurs. That was the game, wasn't it? Away to Spurs. That was the game we would have played if it wasn't for this virus. Away to Spurs. <clears throat> and Ali says the game against... Lazio was my favourite one thus far. Yeah, it was a cracker. It was a real cracker. I, I watched it back uh, yesterday, actually. I did enjoy it. So, uh, what are we doing with our team here? Fred. People are getting tired. This is the problem. People are getting tired at the wrong time of the season. Um, Agarlo played very well. But Martial's tired. A lot of, lot of tired and fatigue in this team at the moment. There's no point having Fozu Menza in there. Let's get Jesse in there. Anybody else can come in and do us a job. Give Maguire a rest. Play Lindelof. It's about, keeping, it's about keeping the team fresh, isn't it? Sim the game, says Daniel Reaction. You're on the wrong channel, Daniel Reaction. And I missed the press conference for Morel Boost, says Kartik. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a Pratt, Kartik. I'm a Pratt. This is what happens. Uh, Pereira is good and you never use him, says RJ Bizzle. And there was me thinking you had decent opinions. Lindelof's been brilliant for me. Why, though? He's been absolutely superb. Sancho's tired. They're all getting tired now. This, this, we're, playing, we're playing three games a week. It's, uh, they're all going to get tired now. This is, the, this is the thing that undoes you on FIFA. You can't keep the morale and everything up. But... Uh, we will be, uh, we're not simming games, Con we don't sim games on this career mode, it's not what we do, unless it's bloody Doncaster at home in the Carabao Cup, we don't do the old sim stuff, because simming's cheating really, when you can lose at home to Bournemouth like I can, there's no right to sim games, it's not, it's not, it's not the right thing to do. But we have got a Europa League semi-final against uh, Getafe to come up as well, um... Dortmund, Wolves, probably the two better teams in it. So we, we avoided those in the semis, which was good. And um, Spurs third in the league. So this will be a, a battle. This is Mourinho as well. It's, it's Goldbridge versus Mourinho. And I think he knows what's going to happen. They've started off quite well. But, right, we move. Why have I picked Dan James from the start? That's not really what my plan was to do. Where's Rashford? I've, I've picked... I've made a right mistake there. I made a right mistake already. Chill out. Oh, look at that. Lucas Moura. Get your groove on. Passings. Oh, Spurs are up for this. The third in league, that's why. Let's 
So Pogba just says, no wonder you're a crap French version of me, Sissoko, with balls like that. It's a, it's a, it's a sketchy start. Oh, ref! It gives the foul on Dan James. I haven't seen uh, Friday Night Dinner. No, I, I, I'm only I'm new, I'm new to the party with Friday Night Dinner. I've not even watched all of season one yet. Good Edda. Uh, Deli Ali, whatever you can know. You know the game's screwed when Deli Ali's good on it. Passing out from the back, it works well. Dan James has got to be quicker than Lachelso. He's he's way quicker. Lachelso, you're, you're running like my gran. Look at this from Dan James. It's so exciting. Oh, he was offside anyway. Mark's the CEO of Pratt, says Dave MC. Mark, thank you for the streams on here. The United Stand has given me the perfect routine each day. Stay safe and God bless to you and our community, says Ezra for PM. Well, uh, that's sort of been the idea with the United Stand. Which of the Academy players are you going to be handing their debut first, says Cavalier Crane Masters. I'll have to have a look at them, to be honest, mate. But yeah, the, the, a bit of uh, a bit of routine doesn't do anybody any harm in, the, in these days. And uh, you've still got your United Stand at 8 o'clock, of course. And uh, we have the morning show around 10. Bruno wants this. Oh, why did that take so long? Dan James, improve your passing ability, but stay fast. Yeah, I've got a bit of a routine going on. I do me uh, I do the morning United stand show. Sometimes we do a one o'clock show. Well, we do a one o'clock show all the time, but I, I do it sometimes. FIFA in the afternoon, eight o'clock show. And then uh, Netflix and chill later on. He's hit the post. 1-0 down. De Gea on his front post again. Thanks, De Gea. Thanks, De Gea, for that. You've done it again. Got done on the front post. Just, oh, that, that's going in anyway. If it doesn't hit the post, it's going in. Because he's crap on his front post. Apparently, this is quite a normal thing. Quite a normal thing, this. Front post is dead on FIFA 20. Well, I did, a, I did an Instagram Live this morning and a lot of people who watch this career mode obviously were saying drop De Gea. Oh, what a turn by Sancho. Sort of gone the wrong way now. All that good play. Oh, yeah, that is for you, Bruno. Go on, Pogba. Good turn. Ah. Martial is offside. Whoa. Was he off? Oh, come on. No, no, no. That's, that's not offside. Right, I'm going to prove this. That was not offside. And I'm going to show you why. Because hide that. When the pass is played, uh, it's, it's, it's marginal. It's bloody marginal, that's for sure. The, certainly the, 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 the animation they showed was after the ball had been played, so. Martial, lovely, lovely hold up play. See you later, Sanchez. Lovely play by Martial. Terrible pass, Martial. Marshall. What are we doing there? Eric Bay, sort yourself out. Twan Seabee's been a massive loss for us. Focus. Focus. I've got to get I've got to get it in my head that Fourth spot's as good as winning the Europa League because it's Champions League football and you could end up with none. We're in a good position at the moment, but you could end up with nothing. Pogba wants it. 
Needs a bit of help. Nice into Dan James. We'll have that, ref. We'll have that. Do not give it to them. Son. Thought he could take on Dan James for pace, then bottled it. Go to him, Wambasaka. Oh, it's two! Oh, De Gea, you're doing well there. wan There's a ball on here. There's a lovely ball on. It's Luke Shaw, he's not really fast enough. Zaheem's missing the Premier League. Happy birthday to Gabe, I saw that. I do, I do wander into the live comments a little bit too much when I'm playing. I, I agree. Imagine how good I'd be if I didn't. Probably not much better. You're not going anywhere, Spurs, with your little passes. Dan James wants this. Yeah, no one's got the pace of Dan James here. Get it out your feet. Oh, should have shot. Should have shot. <sighs> Yellow card. Bruno needs to come off. Well, I've got to do it. First half substitution. This is bad. This is players getting tired at the wrong time of the season. Go on, Sancho. Ah! Oh, Tommy. What a goal! What a goal by Dan James! Scott McTominay and Dan James, the best of friends. They're going to write a book about each other because they love each other and release it on DVD. And they've combined there in what's been a, a battling half from my team. Not very good half, but McTominay grabs hold of it. Nice little layoff. And Dan James first time into the top corner. Retro Fury says the one time you should have shot was that chance with Dan James before. But we're 1-1. This is the first match, yes, uh, Pozoi. We'll take that at half-time. Spurs will be gutted. Mourinho's going to be furious. He was probably already in the half-time smugly walking in. You know what Mourinho does? He's probably already smugly walking in there. I'm 1-0 up. They are 1-0 up. Uh, Jose, I've got something to tell you. What is it? It's 1-1. One, one. You are joking! That fucking goal bridge. Mark, if you're still down in the 70th minute, change to 4-2-3-1 and play long balls to the wingers. And every pass you make, you need to be 100% sure. Says Ready HD. Thanks, boss. But uh, we are one. We, we, we are one. We are one one. And Chelsea and Wolves have already played, so I'm not really interested in what's going on there. I mean, Sancho looks dead, uh, knackered, so he's going to have to come off. Put Rashford on. Swap in with Dan James. My, ta my squad's getting so tired. So tired. Pogba's tired. Lingard can come on for Pogba. We've done that in the past. Mm. Why am I doing a cow impression whilst drinking tea? Pfft. What's all that about? Into rim. Oh, what a turn by Rashford. Send him back. Go on. Oh, Rashford. Lovely little turn that was. Roll it. Martial. Back post. Oh. We've got him on the ropes, people. We've got him on the ropes. 
Harry Cody says, thanks for keeping everyone entertained, Goldbridge. Can I suggest Van de Vaart from Genk, 17-year-old goalkeeper with crazy high potential? You can, you can. Please do drop it in the comments later and I'll read it. I won't remember in the live chat, if I'm honest with you. Shaw's at red card incoming, said somebody there. Oh, too easy for Ndidi, that. Oh, here we go, Jesse. Not played for ages. Oh, I'm celebrating and he's missed. I was celebrating that. I thought it's going in the top corner. How does it not go in? Oh, I thought it was in. I thought it was in. Better team second half, definitely. Definitely. Lingard. Jesse Lingard. Greedy get. Rashford's offside. Love your content. Keep up the great work, says Bobby M. Thanks for watching, Bobby. Um, yeah, so this is our game in hand. We're a point ahead of... We're in fourth place. We're a point ahead of Chelsea and Wer Wolves with a game in hand. But this is our game in hand. So even a point, really, doesn't make a massive difference. It just puts us two points ahead. I'll take that. But if we could get the win and get four points ahead, it gives us breathing space. But Spurs are third in the league as well. I don't think we can catch Spurs, to be honest with you. But... A massive, massive point to get. A massive three points to get. Uh, opinions on the Gre Grealish thing. Um, I do believe in second chances. He has pissed me off. But not, not really in a footballing sense. I, I think it's bigger than that with Grealish. It's what he did when we're all, not, we're all isolating that annoyed me. Go on, Did He needs a runner. Uh, both offside. Go for the near post, says Josh Devlin. A lot of people say that, and I don't know why I don't go near post, because it works for the computer. No one ever dares take on wan -Bissaka. Tomney's doing his job here. Go on, Rashford. He ain't going to catch you. Oh, you should have passed. I'm so greedy with Rashford. I'm such a greedy person when it comes to Rashford here. Could have just passed it across to your mate. Mark, have you ever considered doing a highlights package on your watch-alongs so people who aren't live can watch a highlights video on your channel, says Andrew Chow. Uh, no, I just think people are lazy and they can just watch it back. I mean, I do them every day, so doing a highlights package would just be uh, odd, I think. Should have passed it. I'm not even look. I'm, I'm, I ignore the live comments when I know I'm going to get told off. Should have passed it. This is the first game of the stream, everybody. This is our game in hand against Spurs. Spurs third against fourth, but more important for me, it's about that gap between us and Chelsea and Wolves, who are only a point behind us. Oh, you've sort of. That was a good pass by McTominay. Luke Shaw. Ah, oh, whatever. Luke, you're looking up the line, man. Don't be getting offside. What size TV do I play on? It's not that big. It's only about half a metre in front of me. What a ball. Oh, Martial, two bites of the cherry. Mourinho, after the game, I think my team was better, says free agent. They've been terrible second half. My team's been better. That's it. Go home. If, you, if you've got to go home, go home, Dave, Dan James. Dea. You always give me a heart attack. Rashford wants it. Oh, Luke! You're proper annoying me now. I think I'll have to bring Brandon on. Oh, shit. Jesse. What what a run. wan -Bissaka. What are you doing? Why would you even do that? Shut up, Mourinho. Why would wan play an assist to Son there? It makes no sense. I think I am going to buy Haaland. Oh. Oh, yes, Martial. See you later. I'm going for a run here. From my own half. 
Go on. Go on, Dan James. Go on, Dan James. Go on, Dan James. You've ran past it. He's too fast. Play on, ref. Van Bissaka. Oh, there's a lot of good tackling going on at the moment. Bay, that's yours. Bay, that's yours. Oh, ref, that's not fair. I'm trying to tackle with Eric Bay, and you give me Wan Bissaka back. Hi, Mark. Can you say stop crying, Barry Collins? Stop crying, Barry, Corrin, Barry, Barry Collins, Richie McGeever. That's not fair. I'm trying to tackle with Bay. Lucky he didn't get sent off. I thought I had control of Bay. Sub, sub, sub. Uh, Martial's tired. In for a penny, in for a pound. You've used all your subs. When? Oh, yeah, I have. They're, they're right. They're right. Please subscribe if you're new. Bottom right-hand corner, by the way. Every day we're doing these. Uh, a three-season career is my plan. Uh, we're only on season one. Keeper, 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 keeper. Oh, well done, De Gea. That was down to me as well. Pressing triangle. McTominay wants a runner. That will do. Van James. Into Martial. Ref! He's up! He's got! He's got to give it! He's got to... I can't take penalties. Oh, for God's sake. He's got to give the penalty. It's a stonewall penalty and I can't bloody take him. Which classic match did you vote for in the Man United app? I went for Man City 3-2. I went for the Spurs game. Now, I can't score penalties. I just can't score penalties. I don't even know what to do. Say goodbye to top four. I know. I can't take penalties. And you're definitely not taking it anyway. We'll go Anthony Martial. I'm going to go top corner. Yes! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! I've had about a million penalties on this career. I've had about a million penalties on FIFA. I never score penalties. I never score penalties. And it's and it was definitely a foul, Abdul. He was 100%. But what a penalty this was. Don't even know how I did it, really. <laughs> Nobody's saving that. Not even 10 keepers. Look. It curls into the top corner. He can't, he can't, he, he can't save that. He cannot save that. What a penalty. 2-1. One, this would be a massive three points in our four, top four chances. It will put us four points clear of Wolves and Chelsea in fourth place. A four-point gap with four games to go. Champions League football's coming back to Old Trafford, Ollie. Sit down. And Mourinho. Look at what you could have won. But it's not over yet. We've got to now just dig in for the last ten minutes. Definitely a penalty. I'm just so glad I scored it. What a penalty. I tell you what, it was worth missing all the 50 million I've missed just to score one like that in an important game. But we've got to focus here. Stop, stop bragging. Oh, well done, Rashford. He's given a foul. He's given a foul. What a, what a prat. Oh, I could save the hair. Just blast it. None of that thrown out from the back now. Go on, Dan. Larice. Part of the bus. It's not my style. I'm a I'm a possession man. That is a terrible ball by Ndidi. Tell you what, Lingard's been a good omen though. Tommy, watch out. Foul him if you can. Oh, up we go. Come on. No way, no way, no way. Spurs are chucking the long balls in. This is a massive three points if we get it. Oh, look at him trying to close off the pass. I'm going long here. We're not passing out from the back anymore. De Gea's learnt his lesson. Oh, no. Last attack for Spurs. Ooh, crunch him. The referee has indicated there will be a minimum of three minutes of added time. Oh, McTominay's off. 
Will Goldbridge ever go through a game without a red card? Not Scott, it's fine. Reminds me of Oli Gunnar Solskjaer days. Take one. Get out of the way, Ali. Do one. Get off him, son. Get off. Don't touch me, bitch. That's it. 2 1. I'm too. Uh... I've had a... used up a bit of time. Poor old McTominay. He does get sent off a lot. Oh, Rashford! Keep up. Yes! Get in! Sort out your discipline, says Jamie Sinclair. Sort out your face, Jamie. Lovely goal. Lovely win. Massive result. 2-1. I'll tell you what, at the start of the game, it didn't look like it was going to be like that, did it? How many red cards have we had this season? I don't know. I've always been that sort of a player, even on the pitch. You're holding the shoot button for too long on the penalties. The deviation from the target becomes too large, says Bob Turge. Well, Bob, I love what you're saying, but I'll just show you this penalty back again. Um, probably one of the best penalties you'll ever see because he curls it into the top corner. Keeper can't get anywhere near it. Look at the curl on this from behind the goal. L look at it. Curls it in. Look at that. It's curled in. Keeper can't save that. Oh, look. What, what a penalty. What, what a penalty. Absolutely brilliant. Anthony Martial. I'll give him man of the match for that. Dan James, man of the match. 8.1 for Martial. 8.5 for Dan James. Not a very good performance from the team again. A grafter. Try not to press the sprint button too long. That will save you players fitness. Big three points is ready HD. Thanks for the contribution, pal. Uh, we'll go post-match. This is a big three points, that is. Really, really is. As we move towards that uh, Getafe game. Um, Wolves and Chelsea are just gutted. So just gutted. Despite the win, Sancho. Yeah, Sancho. Sancho. San oh, what have I just done? I didn't read it. He managed to win a close match with his decisive goal. What do you think made the difference in today's game? We were the better team. Um, yeah, Sancho hasn't settled in as well as I would have liked. Dan James had a, has had more impact than uh, than Sancho has, to be honest. But uh, Cameron lit, yes, you can buy Timo Werner. Says Joshua no, Super. No. I mean, I think, I think in relation to the transfer window, I'm only going to sign two players, probably a centre back and a striker. I think that's what we need. Um, and Werner and Haaland are definitely the two on the equation. So. Let's have a look what's going on in the office. McTominay suspended again. Scouting networks. Boring. 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 Okay. So as we look at the league table now, four games to go in the league. And we have got a four point. I mean, look at this though. This is this shows how hard it is. Like We've still got four games to go and we're on 70 points. Like, you will get top four this season in real life with about 63. So, you're going to end up having to get about 78 points to get top four. It's, it's, it's bloody hard going. And Liverpool are probably going to get over 100 points. So, it's difficult. It's difficult to win the title in this, uh, in this, tour, in this thing. Pogba's already on the transfer list, Grit Entertainment official, as is um, as is um, Harry Maguire. It's official. Swap the hair for all black. Best regards. The rabid Wolverine, says Chris Banoir. Um Right. So this game is a difficult one because I need to keep an element of squad freshness because of the game that's coming up against Getafe. So, I'm wary of giving runouts to people. And I think I'm about ready. I think I'm happy with that team. Um, I'd like to give Lingard a bit of game time, actually. Give Lingard a game instead of Bruno. Take off Luke Shaw there. Tomini. Greenwood. Not really got anybody else. Uh, give Romero a run out. No, no, no. no I'm not going to do that. 
Pereira matter. That'll be all right. It's all about Getafe. We've given ourselves a little bit of breathing space now ahead of uh, Getafe on Thursday, but what we can't afford to let happen is slip up. We've got four points ahead of Chelsea and Wolves. Effectively, if we win this game, I think we more or less have hold of top four. So, big game to go and win. Let's turn on the old goal news as well. There's no concurrent matches. Boring. I like it when there is concurrent matches. I'm not playing mattery shit. Sorry, Matter, if you're watching. On FIFA, you are crap. And every time I play Matter, you just don't suit my style because you're just like a bag of cement. I like this one. Rest in peace, Bay, says David Juz. Yeah, but I've only got three fit centre-backs, so somebody's got to play at centre-back. I've only got three. Too many games. I'm, I'm happy with the full-back situation, though. Brandon Williams and Fozu Menza have been really good because my full-backs do a lot of work in my formation. They, they bomb on. Uh, so they do get very tired. So essential that you've got enough uh, fullbacks. And uh, Williams and Fozu Menza have, have had lots of game time. And they're very happy with that. And ball! No, no I'll give it. There is an 8pm show tonight, Hardy. Yep. Yeah. Sancho. I'm so excited about the uh, Getafe game. Goal! Goal! Oh, come on. But I think if we didn't have such a big squad, we'd have been in trouble this season. We've, we've used so many players. Fred! Yeah, lovely little goal. 1-0 already. Fred, Lingard and Agarlo combining. That squad depth for you. Whether it's squad depth enough to go and win a title next season, I don't know. But that's a combination of three players coming into the team and doing fantastically well. Matic, Lingard, Agarlo, Fred. Combinations. Lingard's come back in and done quite well. I've frozen him out for ages as well. Uh, we beat Spurs 2-1, Connor. Uh, somebody just said 393 people have died today, which is obviously tragic um, in the UK. I think that I think that might be down though. But we're, unfortunately, you're looking at numbers and saying yeah, it's down. But it, in the in the wider context of things, it's still a lot of death. Goal! Oh, you were ahead of him. Southampton could be another Villa here. They don't feel very good. At all. Which is good. Oh, don't get stuck under the ball, Harry. But yeah, I think... Um, look. I don't want to take for granted... I don't want to take for granted that we're going to get top four. Because it's still a big achievement to get top four. But... Um, Next season, I think, to catch Man City and Liverpool, that's that's the thing that's going to be difficult. Oh, I thought he'd scored. Good hit by Lingard, that. Hello from Kenya, says Misha. Please do subscribe if you're new, bottom right-hand corner. We've got uh, these daily for you. And uh, it's been a cracking stream. We're sort of getting going in this stream. We started off with that Spurs game, which was a massive win. We'd be expected to beat this one. And then we've got Getafe, first leg, Europa League coming up, which is massive. Semi-final, Europa League. But this is all about getting... The aim of the season was Champions League football. And I'm not bothered how we get it, whether it's Europa League or top four. And I'd like to take the pressure... I want to win a trophy, of course, but I'd like to take the pressure off. I want to win the Europa League, but I'd like, you know, winning the Europa League and it being about the Champions League 
will be quite a lot of pressure. I'd rather be playing that final, playing it for a trophy, rather than it having to be about um, top four, which hopefully we'll get done. Um, Fred scored the first goal, Vug. Oh, I'm enjoying this. Are you enjoying this career mode? I'm really enjoying it at the moment because I'm winning. That's that's why I, the blood pressure's low. Good play by Southampton there. This team's going to have to battle, though. We've got a lot of uh, squad players playing today. Good tackle. Good tackle. Oh, ref! He's just got it in for Dan James. Oh, shut up! Shut up! Absolute the smugness of the red card! It wasn't even the normal animation! The absolute smugness! That's not a red! That's not a red! Just every time you, you you think you're doing well. That's a legit tackle. The smugness of the red card as well. He pulled it out like they pull out the yellows. Oh, just, just shut up. Well, this game is now gone from a situation of being important to essential stay safe and keep up the good work says Vars Vares thank you mate got to play most of this game with 10 men now and I'll tell you what I, lo I love about this game as well they never get yet they never get any red cards they never get any red cards like, it's just not realistic they never well, just tackle more Jesus, Renault. Look at Harry Maguire. Stand him up, Eric. Whoa, good tackling, Eric. Maguire, you're not a left back. We have to battle now. We need we need another bigger Galo performance here. Dan James sent off. Go on. Sancho's scored here. He's already scored. 2-0. Lovely finish. Took his time. That's what you pay £80 million for. Southampton 2-0 down with 10 men. You're cheating shits. Have some of that. Ooh. Lucky in FIFA. The suspension is only one game, says Joey Atham. That's a nice finish by Sancho. Take your time and pick your spot. That should get us over the line, even though still down to 10 men. Using up energy I don't want to need. That was never a red. Yep, yeah, I'll read you out, Jake Mackey. It was never a red. Disgusting decision. Absolutely disgusting. Have that, ref, says Ayub. Exactly. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it, you cheat. Point in there. Anyway, Getafe, massive game coming up next. Can't wait for that. This is a... Uh, Matic will have that. Fred will have that. Fred! Oh, he could have had two! Fred's doing really well in that position. I'll tell you that for free. It was a clear red, says Will Gamers. Nah, I don't think it is. Not in the dynamics of the game. There was nothing... There was nothing... Um, see, he's given another foul against me there. There was nothing malicious about it. It was legitimate slide tackle to win the ball. That's a red. If you didn't get any red cards, you would be fighting for the title mark. Keep up the good work and I will see you in the Champions League next season, says Frostbite. That's a red. And he's not even given the red. This is the red. Look, straight through the back. Oh, that's a red. Dan James wasn't a red. And I don't know why I did that tackle, by the way. That's the, it was, I wasn't doing it as an, as, an, as an example of what a red is. Oh, he's gone. wan has gone. Um, calm down, Mark. Win in the bag. And James can rest, says Andrew Chow. Yeah. I should have been... I shouldn't have read that super chat, though. Anyway, Southampton is shit. 
They're as bad as Villa in the last stream. They're no good. Well, Sancho's having a great game. I hope he gets man of the match today because he's uh, he's been a hard player to settle into this team. Lovely ball, Jesse. Go on, Sancho. Keep going. Harry Maguire. He's still on the transfer list, mate. Oh, Agarlo. Should have scored. Should have scored. Harry Maguire. Oh, that's what I bought you for. You can't even do that well. It's Fosu Menza at right back as well. Referee inconsistency is bad on this. You know, I'm, I like a good tackle. I do, and uh, in a footballing sense, I, I do like a good tackle. It's what I, it's the way I grew up with a good tackle. And uh, see, that's a foul. That was a foul. I don't get it. If I did that up the other end, that's a foul. Legendary Ultimate Football. Please do subscribe if you're new. And um, the game after this is Getafe. Probably what everyone's here for, really. Um, the first leg of the Europa League semi-final. Uh, we do need to make some substitutions at half-time because it's all about freshness now. And we'll get Greenwood on on the wing. Um, everybody else probably isn't going to play in the... Uh... Who's the better player to bring on? Lindorf, obviously. Everyone else ain't going to play, really, so we'll just make those subs. Slabhead, red, red card incoming. All I'm thinking about is all those Wolves fans crying because they're not going to get top four. Go on. Holberg's a monster, isn't he? He's that big, massive thing for Southampton. Could Southampton get back into it? Well, they could. They're not going to, though. Lingard's done really well, I've got to be honest. He has. Ole. Oh, I thought that went in then. Maguire's not coming off, forget that. I'm not wasting wan energy. No way. Yeah, I don't know whether the first leg against Getafe is at United or at, in Spain, but um, what's he doing? Some of these refereeing decisions are ridiculous. We're looking right at that. I mean, I gotta just 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 show you my show show how corrupt the refereeing's been in this game. This is apparently a foul. I mean, look, how is that a foul? Stretches forward, kicks the ball away, gives a foul. It's just ridiculous. This ref's been really bad. It's only because I'm so good I'm not losing. It's dodgy as anything. It's just not a foul. This is what I mean. I've had Dan James sent off and it wasn't a foul. Dodgy. I'm not taking Aaron Maguire off. Refs are shocking, says Buster Cher. This one's been awful today. Go on. I don't think Agarlo's quick enough there. Play on. Ah, oh, that was a foul, to be fair. Oh, I was never a foul, Lorenzo. Never a foul. Do not even know what they're talking about. Good job I didn't slide tackling there.
It seems a long time ago since Sancho's goal. Go on, Brandon Williams. Corner ball. Always kept it in. We're away, we're away first to Qatar faces FXLRO. That's good. It's always good to be away first. Oh, Matic. I, I love a good smashing shot with Matic. Oh, God, we've, we've been bad second half, haven't we? As long as Southampton don't score. It's been one of those job done games and we're all thinking about Getafe. Come on, let's go up a level now. Oh, Freddy, what it? You got it. I'm not taking Harry Maguire off. I've only got one sub left. Harry Maguire's not playing in the next game, so I'm not... I'm not oh, it's, I've done it. Bloody hell. Hi, Mark. Remember me. Great seeing United stand do well, says Blaine the Pickle. Thanks for the contribution, mate. Waiting for Peaky Blinders Season 6. You'll be waiting for a long time, Akalish, because they've stopped filming it. So it's not even being filmed at the moment. So I don't think we're going to see it this year, I'm afraid. They were just about to start filming it and they had to cancel it because of uh, the virus. So, yeah, we're not going to see that. Up we go. Remember, we're doing this with 10 men as well. Oh, Matic. So if they could get a if they could get a second if they could get a goal, they could set up a good finish here, Southampton. How much do they want it? Not enough, I don't think. Well, Lingard's done well there. Good tracking back. He's put the graft in. Fred, lovely reverse pass. Brandon Williams, go! Got not really got any pace. Oh, he's probably knackered, Brandon. Getafe coming up next, the big, big game. But we have to get these league games done. And I tell you what, if we've taken six points from Spurs and Southampton, I'm happy. I'm very happy. And Wolves and Chelsea aren't. That was the main thing. Garlo's had a crap game again today. This is the thing about Garlo. He has... Like, Villery was untouchable. Liverpool in the cup, untouchable. And then other games, he's crap. Maguire's on the transfer list, Evan. And so's Paul Pogba. That's the big... That's the big potential transfer story of the summer. Goldbridge has had enough of Pogba, which is controversial. I've still not quite made my mind up yet about Pogba. I just don't... I find him a bit inconsistent for the player that he is. Lingard running straight into danger. That was poor by me. Here he is. Eden Hazard. Redmond. So just jockey him. Oh, Matic needs a runner here. He can't do it himself. It's a lovely little ball by Matic. And Fred does well. He needs to pass. He finds Lingard. He'll go wide to Lin Matt Fozo Menza. Into Agalo. Little dink. Fred! Oh, God, Fred. Oh, Fred. I think we might have a penalty here. For some reason, I think we might be getting a penalty. I don't even know why. What's this all about? We're looking at this guy a lot. I don't know what you. I don't know what you've done, mate. I don't know. It's just, it's just having a walk. What we're we doing, ref? <laughs> just, we don't. We don't know what's going on here. Oh, maybe a penalty for pulling down Greenwood. Yep. Yeah. Agarlo. Going to go top corner here. It's 
penalty. They bloody save it again. I can't score penalties. That's a nice ball. Another missed penalty. The ref's had a bloody nightmare, hasn't he? I don't know what the ref... This ref's been awful. Thank God we didn't need to score that penalty. Because I can't score him. And the Saka playing well at centre-back. Penalty was a handball. We have got handballs on. They just never get given, hardly ever. Greenwood, he's going to have a little bit of a run here. It's opened up for Greenwood. Lingard. Rampasaka. Uh, Lingard. Agalo. Southampton have been absolutely atrocious. So much so that it's been a walk in the park with 10 men for most of this game. We've still had more than enough quality. And a clean sheet for De Gea. And it is a clean sheet for De Gea. Fred man of the match, people are saying, uh, aim the penalty in the corner and move back to the middle just before kicking the ball, says Eric Menzies. Okay. And uh, thanks everyone who's watching. Please do subscribe if you're new. We've got nearly 7,000 people watching. I've noticed how the watching numbers have gone up the closer we get to this big game of the stream, which is the first leg against Getafe. But what I would say is, and Fred is man of the match, well done everybody who picked that out. Um, again, not, not a fantastic performance, but at this time of the season, performances are not as important as results and that is a very very important result for us because with three games to go we will still be at least four points ahead of uh, Chelsea and Wolves in that race for top four Dan James sending off if I could say refs of Pratt I would have done Nice morale boost as we go into this next game. Thank you. I just want to have a quick look ahead of this. Well, let me just do some training first. Get my tracksuit on. Ready for Getafe, says Adam Croy. We are. This is where it gets out. Getafe, get out, eh? Exactly. Advance. Right. I just want to have a look at something before we do this Barcelona Liverpool in the Champions League Man City Bayern in the other that's a crap that's where we're coming that's us next season get in Champions League that's where we want to be that's where we want to be Liverpool in the Carabao Cup Spurs against Man City in the FA Cup because we knock Liverpool out but in the league we've got a four point gap on Chelsea and a four-point gap on Wolves. They're still pushing us a little bit. It's not done yet. That fourth spot's not done yet. But look at that. Look at that. We're a point behind Spurs. They've got to win their game in hand to keep themselves. We could we could end up getting third place. But now it's all about the Europa League. Mark, what CM are you going to, going for since you're selling Pogba, says Joshua Supel? I don't know. We've got, ooh, Man City are interested in Harry Maguire. This is interesting. He's valued at £28 million. Um... Delegate. I want 40, 46. There we go. Dan James, loan offer. Atletico Madrid. I think Dan James is too too important a player. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna reject that offer and I think I'm gonna keep Dan James. But been a very good player. For us, uh, McTominay's back. Dan James is obviously suspended. <sighs> I wanted to let you. What do you want to let me know, Marcus? I'm brilliant. I 
I didn't, I didn't even know I dropped you, Marcus. Sell him, says Jake Mackay. Some people are saying don't sell him to City. Mate, he's crap on FIFA. If City want to buy Harry Maguire and play him, happy days. Transfer offer for Pogba as well. Let's have a look. Liverpool want Pogba. Uh, I... I'm going to delegate and say... They'd have to give me 80 million. Saw a click of you saying close him down to Matic in the Everton game. Always watch your compilations when I'm bored. Says Fitness and Spritz is Um We'll do the press conference. I think it'd be funny if Pogba went to Liverpool. Actually, it would be absolutely stupid. I don't know why I've done that. This morale up. Oh, can I um can I stop that Pogba thing or have I just done something stupid? I think I can just go in and reject. I'm gonna reject. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. Um, right, squad. I need to sort. I need to sort this out anyway because the team's all over the place. Martial, look at look at all those green bars. That's what I like to see. All the green bars. Everybody's fit for the biggest game of the season. Everybody wants to play. This is what we want to see. Pogba, Bruno. James for Rashford. That's my best team. Fozu Menza. Juan Basaka. Luke Shaw. Brandon Williams. Bailly. Maguire. And Maguire. For Lindelof. That's the team. That's the team. I'm not selling... I don't want to sell Pogba to Liverpool because he'll make Liverpool better. So I don't want to do that. Um, it's as simple as that. Right, massive game this. Getafe. I don't know anything about Getafe. Oh, what I do know, what I do know about Getafe in this um, actual season. We'll have we'll have that. That'd be good. Um, they're like mid table in La Liga in the FIFA season, so they ain't that good. So it should be an easy, easy route into the final. Mm -hmm. The champions. We're not in the Champions League. Here we go. Europa League semi-final, leg one. Mark, you need to read your alerts and emails a lot more in depth. Thanks, Pat. Uh, please do subscribe if you're new, bottom right-hand corner. And if you have subscribed, please share the button. We've got nearly 7,000 people watching for this Europa League semi-final leg one. Getafe, Manchester United. It looks like we've nailed down top four. But now we're looking to win a trophy in our first season uh, with me at the wheel. And maybe it's what Ollie would have achieved. Maybe it's what he still could achieve. But it's what we're looking to achieve. And how good will Getafe be? Is the question. On everybody's lips. Get moving Pogba. That's a terrible ball Sancho. Are Getafe set up to cause a problem. For Manchester United here. Are they, the, are they going to be the shock? And I love this. I love this. This is what I love about the European games in on FIFA. When you get to see all the other grounds, it, they feel atmospheric. As long as I don't lose. And this is why I want to be in the Champions League. Play some big teams, the Juventuses of, of, of the tournament and that. Here we go. Bruno, there's a pass on there. What a ball. Sancho, 
He's quicker than that guy who's got long hair. Sancho. He's done it! Jaden Sancho, two in two. Went near post there. Everyone said to go near post. It all comes from Bruno, the guy with long hair. The B-Tech Pot Perlo can't keep up with him. Sancho gets close, beats him on the front post. He's just as good as De Gea. 1 0. And an away goal early on. These, this is what you do. Away from home in Europe, you've got to get the away goal. We did it in Lazio and we gave them all up, but. Uh... Oh, I'll tell you what, they're, they're dithering on the ball, Getafe. Remember I said Getafe, they're, they're, they're mid-table in La Liga at the moment in this, in this actual season. So they're not all that. We don't need to be scared of them. Get this game done, Europa League final. And Martial wants it. Oh, you should have made that pass there. On the break, Getafe are shit. He's in again here. Martial, Sancho. Oh, what a hit. Hit it early that time. And Getafe look like they're playing with nine men at the moment. United are rampant. The rampant rabbits. Enjoyable and energetic. Martial into the box. Little turn. He's looking for something. Oh, he didn't find it, but he's got the ball. Into Ndidi. Into Bruno. He's going to smash this low. Oh, they're all over them. The travelling United fans are loving this at the moment. They can sense a final. I don't know where the final is being played, by the way. If anyone does, get it in the live comments. On oh, the bar! What's he doing? It's a goal kick. Good start. Doesn't mean a lot. If you don't build on it. But Getafe not offering very much at the moment. And United are offering a hell of a lot. And then Diddy's played a lovely ball in. And Sancho's the danger here. Sancho into the box again. Sancho. Little cut back. Pogba on the volley. Oh. Get the ball to Jaden Sancho. That's the chance at the moment. That would be a funny chant. Get the ball to Jaden Sancho. Oh, what a goal! What a goal! Bruno Fernandes pulls it out in the biggest of games. What a hit! Bruno Fernandes, 2 0 inside 20 minutes. United could have this tie done already. Lord, look, what a hit by Bruno Fernandes in the Europa, Europa League semi-final. Pick it out and send it back to Santa and deliver it to someone for Christmas. One little touch. It's out, it's out, it's out, it's in. It's bending in. It's a cracker. It's 2-0. And the final will be in Poland. Thank you, everybody. And well, I tell you what, the last couple of streams, I don't think we've been playing that well. But if we're finding the form now at the end, and I tell you what, Getafe are as bad as Villa were. How have they got this far in this tournament? It shows you the quality of the Europa League that this side is a semi-finalist in the Europa League Getafe because they are trash at the moment. And they are trash in relation to their league as well. And this could be three. He ain't going to catch Sancho here. Sancho. In it. Oh, is it the post? It could have been Orvo. United a final bouncers, Jake. They could have been 3-0 up at half-time. Absolute domination from United here. But can Getafe get back into it? Have they been given a reprieve by that shot by Sancho hitting the post? They don't know how to deal with this Goldbridge United at the moment. They just can't deal with it. And Sancho, that is a foul. It's right in front of you, ref. You cheat. That's right in front of you. You're a disgrace to referees. You are a disgrace, man. You are an absolute joke. You are a disgrace. What a joke. Oh, God. How has he not given that foul? Everything's going on here. Jason's taking a corner. Where's Kylie? Off we go. The tenacity and pace of United has just been too hard for Getafe to deal with. And look at that again. And did he read in the pass? The flicks are going everywhere. Wambasaka wants in on the action now. He's in on the action. He's coming in. He's looking on the back post. It's Sancho. Oh, what a clearance. I was ready for a volley. 
And gets out. It's, it's ended here again. And it's another. Oh. You know what? It is just winning everything at the moment. And it's Bruno. This is for three. It's three. They can't live with them. They can't live with them. This is a statement. This is a statement to next year. This is a statement to the rest of Europe. This is a statement to the rest of England. They're absolutely all over them. Bruno's got two. Getafe are done in. And United are oh, Polish by Poland bound. Poland bound. Oh, if, if, if I knew a Polish dish, I'd, I could do a good line. But this is Champions League beware next season. Because United have been superb. You can only do what's in front of you. As my mate used to say. If it's if it ain't that good looking, but it's all that's left in the disco, you do it. And he, lit, and he did. Oh. Three away goals. You should sim the second leg, says Jack the Red. I don't really want to be simming any, any games, but I sort of agree with you. You're all over them. Put the game to bed, says Johnny Wilson. I've never, I've just seen a comment there. I've never seen a team this shit in a Europa League semi-final. And to be honest with you, I think many of us would agree. They have been absolutely shocking. Oh, and Bruno's hat-trick was there. And he somehow heads it wide. Well, this has been a holiday to Spain so far. Wolves are winning. We, I missed that goal. It could be an all-English final. Dortmund and Wolves in the other semi-final. It could be all English. But Getafe should be embarrassed. He was never 10 yards, ref. It's like they came out with eight men and they left a couple of them in the dressing room having a siesta. They've been awful. It's just been too easy. Bruno... Oh, is it the post? <laughs> Just unbelievable from uh, United. And uh, Pogba wants it. Pogba wants in on the action. Oh, you wonder how many this could be. They could play the kids in their semi-final at this rate. Legendary. It's This is legendary, Sadie. It's not my fault. Guitar for your shit. Goal. They've got one back. And they've got one back. And it was a good goal, that, from Getafe. Luke Shaw's furious. And it's the it's the BTEC Perlo with the cross. And he does really well, actually. That's a good volley. 3-1. Could, could have been 5-0. 3-1. Absolute angel. He, he rose like an angel. 3-1 um, absolutely flatters them. They'll be over the moon to be 3-1 down. Well, is there now going to be a shift in the game? Stranger things have happened. Rashford. Not be, not even been in the game, Rashford. Not in the game, Marcus Rashford, at all. Who would have thought that? Oh, he sent Luke Shaw back to England there. Jason. Well, maybe, maybe, maybe guitar, guitar. They've just had a bad half an hour. Maybe they can get back into it. Maybe not. Ref, you really need to blow up for half time now. Well, that 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 first half has exhausted me. That has exhausted me. Sancho made it 1-0. Let's watch that back. It front post. But, um... And Wolves are winning in Germany. That's a big away goal there. Second half coming up. Could have been 5-0. This is not the game we expected. We, we, we expected a better Getafe than this. Still Rashford. Sort of fighting his way through here without any skill. United just need to keep up the intensity in this game of what they've shown so far, which has been magnificent. Some of the best football I've seen. 
Martial, Rue, oh, Rashford. Oh. Bruno. Oh, he's got that. He's got the groove on today, Bruno, with that curler. And Jad wants 10 1. I don't think we're going to quite do that. Sometimes these second halves don't live up to the first half, but I'm trying to. Trying to keep the intensity going. That's the thing. Bruno. Oh. It's interesting because what some people had said, swap Bruno and Pogba and play Bruno off to the left. And he's had he's had an absolute, an amazing game doing that. Harry Maguire on the move to Man City. Look, maybe. We don't know. It could be two. Oh, I tell you what, they don't deserve that, but they did if they'd scored it. Nice ball there. Rashford. It's not had a good game, Rashford, today. Dan James is saying, get me on. Bruno. Out to Shaw. Puts it in first time. Oh, and Wolves are winning 2-0, top right. Wolves are 2-0 up against Dortmund. Of course, Dortmund don't have Sancho because I have got him. But I still would have thought Dortmund would have... We're looking at an all-English final just like we did last year. Chelsea against Arsenal last year. We're looking at Wolves and United this year. At the moment, things can change quickly. Bruno's man of the match. There's no doubt about that. Rashford. Dan James is saying, please bring me on. Rashford's playing terrible. Keep the concentration. Oh, and Diddy. He's been very good as well. Martial, get your legs on here. Go on, Anthony. Oh, he's in. Oh, come on. Sub time. I think people are getting tired. It's time for subs. I'm going to put Rashford through the middle, actually. Take Martial off. Get Dan James on. Greenwood. Sancho. Rest me front two. Lingard. Pogba. That will do. Three subs. And did he? You're off. You're offside. Who's offside? <sighs> Thanks everyone for tuning in. 7,000 watching. We're getting to the business end of the career mode. That's why. Uh, remember, we will be back tomorrow as well. Still going on this one. Don't worry, we're not, not near the end yet. But please subscribe if you're new. Bottom right hand corner. Getting close to 137,000 subscribers. Uh, please subscribe if you're new. And share the video, of course. I'd love to see Bruno get a hat trick. Not, not, Rashford's been proper bad today, and it, and it's and it's quite similar to what Rashford's all about. I tell you what, if they get a goal back, it would set the second leg up a little bit more interesting than it ever should have been. This is not a three-one game. It certainly shouldn't be a three-two game. Go on, Greenwood. You've run in there. Bruno. Oh, he's hit the inside of the post. Ah, oh, he's hit the post twice. Twice on two goals. Bruno Fernandes has hit the post and been denied a hat trick. The quintessential performance from him. Lingard. Now Bruno. Oh, they're trying to set him up when they should actually be putting the game to bed. Stop trying to get Bruno to score the goals. Brilliant by wan -Bissaka. Dan James. Lingard. Bruno. Oh, 
Again, we're trying to score that goal for Bruno when actually we should just try and win the bloody game 3 4 1. Luke Shaw, we've won so many second balls in this game. Getafe have just not been able to deal with the tenacity of this fantastic performance from every player. The amount of tackles we've won in good areas. Bruno. Oh, just so greedy with Bruno. I'm so greedy with Bruno. I want to score the hat trick. I think it's over. I think it's over, but you just don't know. Mangasaka. Lingard. That's the ball. Dan James. What a ball. What a ball by Bruno, that is. He wants it back. Got a goal. What a goal. I don't know what I hit there. What a goal this is. Dan James. Bruno started it. Laid it off to him. Oh, have that. What a goal to complete it. What a goal to complete the hat trick by Fernandez. He was the one who played it to Dan James. Dan James was the, pa was the person who passed it back. And Bruno Fernandez sends a statement to Europe. What a signing he is. What a player he is. Hat trick. 4-1. Getafe. Get out of the Europa League. You were never good enough. Why you got this far, I don't know. Because United have absolutely dominated you. And it's Bruno. And he's got four. Calmness personified. Rashford plays it through. He's just got... He's oozing lube and quality. Bruno Fernandes just didn't panic. Didn't panic. He's like, watch this. I'm going to take my time. There you go. 5-1. It's 2-1 in the Wolves game. Dortmund have got a goal back. But Bruno Fernandes has stepped... Oh, this next season, we, we should be looking at the Champions League next year and, and, and roaring. Absolutely stunning performance. Stunning performance from Bruno Fernandes. If, if I could give him higher than a 10, I would. Just absolutely turns up to the party again. In what's been... He's been a little bit quiet recently, actually. But... Oh! Well, they don't deserve that. All-time performance from Bruno, says Jake McKay. Getafe, what are you celebrating for? It's embarrassing. You don't even deserve 5-2. Can we appreciate the camera switch? I wish, I wish I'd meant it. I think I did that. I'll have to watch that back myself. Imagine if I'd meant that. Dan James. Dan James. Dan James. Oh, he should have set a goal up there. Up you go, Jesse. Rashford. Yes! 6-2! What a performance! What a performance! Just unbelievable! That is a statement of all statements. And Marcus Rashford gets his goal. Took it well. Took it very well. Getafe, look at them all shaking your heads. You're shite. Terrible defending. Lingard wins the header. Rashford takes it down and volleys it in the bottom corner. Lovely goal. 6-2. I think we're going to have to sim the second leg. There's absolutely no point, is there? You know, we're just not... It's not going to not happen, is it? Happy 21st birthday to Anthony Pizzani. This is Tau1872. Nice little thing there. Surprised the ref didn't give a pen there. Cross comes in. Get rid. I don't want to concede another one. Six two. Six two. Take a bow, lads. Absolutely brilliant. The Bruno Fernandez semi final. Give him the ball. Give him two default. They can't even define him. He's called, he's called undefined. Because Fernandez isn't even good enough. He's just he, he eclipses his own name. Even the Spaniards are clapping him off. What a game. What a performance. 6-2. Bruno Fernandes is going to get a 10. There's no doubt about that. But what about, what about everybody else? 9.2 Rashford. 8.4 Dan James. Sancho on the bench. 9.5 because he was taken off. Lingard 6.9. And Diddy was fantastic. 9.3. Luke Shaw 8.3. Bay and Lindelof 8.1s. And Diddy was absolutely superb. He won so many. I mean, I think he deserves his own man of the match because Bruno was just so good. 
Uh, we are going to be going to the final, definitely. Definitely going to be in the final. Um, stunning performance. Our best performance of the season. I mean, Getafe were a bit crap, to be honest, but... I don't think anybody could have lived with us today and it's exciting for the second leg. Um, sorry, it's exciting for next season where we can go and what we bring in. And does Pogba stay? Do we need Pogba? Do you build the team around Bruno, in fact, and, and get rid of Pogba and use that money to, to bring others in? Um, surely you've qualified. Um, we can still improve. Yeah, just keep keep them on their toes. Martial. Don't know what Martial did. Thoughts on Aubameyang moving to United from an Arsenal fan, says Jack. I don't think it will happen. Fernandez is a, uh, he's a superstar. Bruno Fernandez, oh, just just unbelievable form, performance from him today. Absolutely fantastic, and um, I, I, I just can't I can't talk about it enough. He was absolutely brilliant. Uh, we've had a transfer offer. We've already dealt with that. Uh, youth squad monthly report. Let's have a look. He's looking good. 15 years of age. Look at his potential. Can't even promote him at the moment. He looks like being the superstar. Odegaard. 83 to 89 potential. Right. Let me just have a quick look at something here. Calendar. So what I'm thinking is, I'm going to sim the second leg anyway. I'll play the Palace game now. Sim that, and then tomorrow will be the final with West Ham and Leicester. So yeah, we'll do one more. Should we do one more? Just to keep it uh, realistic. I don't want the final to be game four, you see, on a stream. You need to be building towards that final. What's the problem I've got to fix here then? Van James. John. people the rest I'm actually gonna I'm gonna start John Um, the final will be played in Poland, apparently. Or oh, away to Palace. Hmm. Tough game, you know. There's still, you know, what you've got to look at is if I did lose the final and I didn't get and I, and I, and I bottled top four, we're still back in the Europa League. So this game, these league games, let's not all be thinking about the final. Um, I don't want it to be final or bust. I want it to be final bonus, and that we've already got Champions League football certain because we've uh, we've got it uh, on lockdown in the league. Bruno's already the same rating as Pogba. Six two Man United says Abdul Akto. That was a fantastic game. Anyway, can we? The, the thing is, this game is as important in some ways because. We've got that four-point gap on Wolves and Chelsea. But Wolves are obviously brilliant because they're in the final of the Europa League and they're right behind us in the league for top four. So they're obviously going to... I think Wolves are going to keep getting results. It's a lovely ball. Mason Greenwood, can he get it out of his feet? Goal. Chong. 
First touch in a Man United shirt this year and he's scoring a tapping. 1-0, Greenwood and Chong. Lovely little ball into Greenwood. He gets his shot off. Where's the left right back for them? I don't know, but Chong will never score an easier goal. 1-0. And that's that alleviates a lot of the pressure in this game. I don't want it to, I didn't want this game to be a battle. Getting closer to that finish line. We've got Leicester away last game of the season. I think we've got I can't remember who we've got in the our last home game. So Get three points here and you really can't see us blowing to fourth spot. I'll have a foul there, ref. Obviously not. So tomorrow's stream will be the Europa League final stream. Do not miss it. I will say I'm going to be live at half past two, hopefully. I might even knock it back to three o'clock. Fozu Menza. Greenwood. The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. 2-0. Greenwood scored. Chong has scored. Crystal Palace are 2-0 down. This United side is just on fire. Absolutely on fire. I just hope we, I hope we can keep it going. West Ham then Leicester, says Abdul. Watch out. Watch out. Oh, shut up. Shut up. That's just one twos. That's one twos and they've carved you open. I tell you what, it's the calamitous two at the back. I know in real life they're good, Bay and Maguire. But on this, and this game, I actually dropped them for Lindelof and Twansebi. And that's where my season turned around. Maguire and Bay are crap together. And they've just been carved open. Carved open. Like an elephant through a glass door made of candy floss, not glass. Lingard. Well, this game is now a little bit harder than it should have been. Sancho. Oh. Ref, don't let Crystal Palace get back into this game. Chong. Two nil becomes two one. Chong, he fancies it today. Oh, who hit that? Those who men's are. Agarlo's not permanent on the game, Ollie Willard. No, he's um, he's on loan in the game. Greenwood. Oh, what a bad ball that was. Chong was absolutely in acres. 3-1, Pogba. How crap a palace. How crap a palace. They're awful. They're absolutely awful. Chong with the ball into Lingard. Cross comes in. And Pogba's there to tap it in off the defender. The momentum of United at the moment. We're probably one of the best teams in Europe. We're just, we're just in the wrong league. Everybody just wants to play for Goldbridge. Fozu Menza. Playing like one of the best right backs in the game. Chong. I've hardly ever picked him. Loving life. Have we played any good de teams there? The Spurs game, first foot, first half, Spurs were good. Um, Um, but who else have we played today? Getafe. Okay, <laughs> now I, I don't even know what went wrong with them.
Thank you very much. Paul Pogba free kick, 4-1. He's come to the party, Pogba, today. He's sort of saying, why are you going to sell? Why are you going to sell? And I'll tell you what, that's the comment of the day from Noise Code. It is morale. On career mode, you get your morale up and your team plays absolutely superbly. Lovely free kick by Paul Pogba there. Over the wall, 4-1. And it's not semi-pro, it's legendary. I'll, I'll, I'll prove it to you afterwards. I, I love these people who turn up and say, semi-pro, semi-pro, because I'm playing well. We've not won anything yet. People just don't want you to do well in life, that's it. Is Delo better than Fozu Menza? He's very good to sell at Army. I just prefer Fozu Menza to, to Delo on FIFA. Look, Harry Maguire's not a bad player. Um, I just prefer... Fozu Menza. Keep Pogba, says Rafi Contour. I'll tell you what, he might be playing himself into the team. And I, no wonder he's playing himself into the team to stay. Because he's like, this team's going places. My three-year plan was always... Um, get into the Champions League this season and win a trophy. We're on course for that. I mean, the Europa League final looking like it's going to be Wolves. That's going to be an absolute banger tomorrow. Um... I'm really pleased if we finish fourth. It's not easy to finish fourth on Legendary. It isn't. I've, I, my, I did a career mode before and we got nowhere near fourth. Since Lazio come back, you've been on fire, says Jake McKay. They have. They have. They've been, they're absolutely superb at the moment. And for the two, stream, the two, the two uh, streams before that, we were awful. It does, go in, it does go in spurts at the moment. It just feels like morale, isn't it? Everything we touch is, uh, is gold. Gold Bridge. Yeah, I'm going to sim the second leg of the Guitar Faker. I don't normally believe in simming games, but we've won 6-2. There's just no... There's no value in, in playing that. Pogba. Pogba is playing really well today. Are you still going to sell Pogba and Maguire to sell at Ahmed? Uh, they are very good players. Uh, they're just very inconsistent in the game. That's the main reason to sell them. My plan was, actually, because next season it's about how you can close the gap on Liverpool and Man City. So my plan was to sign a striker and a... Uh, sign a striker and, um, and a centre-back. Because we do need some centre-back help. What's that, Pat? What a ball! Oh, what a miss! Oh, wow, wow. Mason Greenwood. What a ball by Sancho. And what a miss by Greenwood. Don't sim, says Divash. I think at 6-2 we can sim it. And if I lost, I'd replay it anyway. Because it's not, it's not fair. I'm only doing it to save us a bit of time. Yeah, so I was thinking of getting Haaland in the summer and up a Meccano and not buying anybody else. But now, with Pogba, if we sold him, we'd have to buy somebody else. And maybe maybe I will keep Pogba for another year. I don't know. Don't sell Pogba, says Obim. Well, it's, it, on today's performance, you wouldn't sell him, that's for sure. Mason Greenwood's getting better and better as well. You, you, you've seen the improvement of Greenwood over the season. Alex McCulmery says, did he beat Getafe? Did he beat Getafe? Did he beat Getafe? Yeah. We did. I'm going to give Bruno half a game. I'm going to give Rashford half a game. Uh, why break up winning formula by selling Pogba, says Barry Haynes. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. 
Gallo on for Greenwood. Keep Maguire as backup, says Angry. I don't I just don't like Maguire. He's just he's just not my sort of a player. He's slow. He's and he's oh, the thing about Maguire is he's cost me so many goals in the air. And that's not you know, that's meant to be his strong point, so I'll tell you what, Fred's a very good player though. Midfield wise, we might need a replacement for Matic at some point, but we're well, we're well stacked in the midfield with people like Bruno with uh, Fred and McTominay as the backups. Hopefully, get a young player coming through. So I'd only I'd only be looking to buy somebody if if uh, if I did sell Pogba. Chong, he needs a loan. I couldn't I couldn't I've been trying a lot. I've been trying to loan Chong out all season. Look at Luke Shaw. He's knackered on that side. You heard of Saul to replace Pogba rumours, says Salah Ahmed. Um, yeah, this is never going to happen. Never play ultimate, it's broken, says Joshua. I've heard loads of people talking about ultimate saying it's broken. I've played it a couple of times. I do find it hard. Um, I'd consider playing on ultimate if I'd already got top four on a league game. Oh, God. We still concede a lot of goals. Still conceding a lot of goals. That's a dodgy goal as well. That's just laziness. We've got any more subs? Luke Shaw does need to come off. Alright, so sorry Luke. I think Luke Shaw might collapse at the end of this game. Vitzel's very good. I've had Vitzel before, you am. Yeah, he's very good. I'm feeling tired myself now, I've got to be honest. Four games, it's a long slog to stream. How long we've we been live since half two? Nearly two hours. It's tough. I think the uh, we were purring against Getafe. To be honest with you, it was absolutely magnificent. We've got to be a little bit careful in this game. I mean, we've been absolutely dominant, but I don't think Palace are stupid. I think if we gave them another goal. They could cause trouble, but Rashford, he's too fast. He's too fast for Sacco, surely. No, he's not. If you sell Pogba, get Fabian from Napoli, says Jake McKay. Oh, I thought I'd done the old throw out there. It's a ball. Rashford, whip it in low. Nathan Aki is good on FIFA sprinkles. I might, I might look at him. I, I like Upper Meccano, but I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind getting Aki either. Uh, if you've not subscribed, please do. Uh, Manchester United FIFA career mode. Uh, we do it every day. Uh, the plan is to do a three-year career mode. My plan in the first season was always Champions League football and the trophy, which. You know, you've got to have high aspirations, and some would say, well, that's not that high, but actually, it can be. Oh, God! Shit! Shit! This, this, this would be a joke. This would be a joke. It was a 4-1 up. Yeah, season two is about a title charge. And hopefully a title win. And then season three is about retaining it. Is De Gea safe from the Goldbrid Hatch? Says Salah. Oh, lovely turn. Oh, he should have scored. Bloody hell, we needed that goal as well. 20 minutes. Fred needs a pass here. Bruno. 
Cool. He's got such a good shot. Chris Stambull. Everyone's saying Chris Stambull. We've got to be careful here. Roy's there. He's sending Zahar on. Why didn't he start him? Why didn't I head that? Lethargic performance from Goldbridge in this last game. Can he hold on? It looked over. At the moment, it's not. What am I doing there? Where's my bloody defence? Up we go, Luke. Well done. Palace are having a go at this. Garlo. Zaha up against Luke Shaw, who's nearly dead. This is a, a mismatch. Made in heaven. Legarlo's basically playing as a left back now. Oh shit. Rashford. What's going on? Oh, I think this has got a draw written all over it. Get rid. Oh. Calm it down. Don't roll it out. Don't roll it out. What's that? What is going on here? Can't keep the ball. Can't keep the ball. Do not drop three points here. That's all I'm saying. Well done, Luke Shaw. Corner ball. Here we go. And again. And again. Run it. Go on, Jesse. Go on. Keep going. Go on, Igarlo. Yeah, go on. Give him a push. Eighty-five. Well done, Luke. Sure. He needs a pass here. That is one of the worst, best passes I've ever seen from Eric Bay. Chongi. He's done absolutely nothing in this game, Chong. <laughs> and he's still done nothing. Well, he scored a goal, but he's, he's way nowhere near good enough. Well done, Lingard. Chong, just run into that space. Oh, look at him. He's crap. He's proper crap. Well, I'll tell you what. That is a massive three points. Massive three points. <laughs> we made a lot of work out of that. A lot of work out of that. And it didn't need to be. We were 4-1 off after about half an hour, and it ends up 4-3. Dodgy game, really. I don't, oh, yeah, Pogba's man of the match because he got two goals, didn't he? But, uh, yeah, apart from that, it was just... Uh, a scintillating first half an hour and then yeah tiredness is is what i would say wolves look at wolves they ain't gonna let up do ultimate team or you've got a small willy says connor mckinnery um wolves are not gonna give up on this race for top four and there's a decision to be made over pogba in the summer big win all the questions we have for you. Bundesliga is discussing to be going on. I think they will. I think the Bundesliga will come back first. They're already training, and that's totally up to them, isn't it? If they decide to do that. So, I've I've always said this. Whoever brings the league, I mean, imagine if they had Bundesliga football in the middle of April. We'd all watch it, wouldn't we? Because we're just desperate for football. So whoever gets back gets back. Right, we're going to sim this next game um, just to get it done. Just to see who we get in the final. <laughs> Man City have agreed to pay 52 million for Harry Maguire. Well, I'm not bothered. Thanks, Harry. You've been a great servant. 
and uh, thanks for all you've done. Goodbye. Um, simple as that. I'm, I'm very happy with that. I'm very, very happy with that. So we'll sim this game. I, I, sh I could have even changed the team. 1-0 win. Greenwood with the goal. Gerard, don't slip it. Marks is ready HD. We've comfortably got through there. So we will go into the final. And I presume the final will be against Wolves. But let's have a look. Let's have a look at our last few games then. This will be on tomorrow. There you go. West Ham, Leicester and Wolves will be the Europa League final. That is tomorrow. Uh, we're looking forward to that, of course. Um, let me just have a quick look at the transfer hub. His value is 28 million and Man City want to give me 52 for a million for a player I don't want anymore. I'm accepting that. Off you go. Disagree if you want. I'm accepting it. Uh, so two games to go. Let me just re let me just say tomorrow's stream then will be the Europa League final against Wolves. But it's not just all about that. We've got two games to go and we haven't actually got top four yet. We're still four points clear of Chelsea and Wolves. One more win will do it. That four points with two games to go. One more game will do it. But our last game of the season is Leicester uh, away and West Ham a ninth. So they're not easy games tomorrow. Three big games. Massive stream tomorrow. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Bottom right-hand corner. And we could still get third. But Wolves and Chelsea just won't slip up. 80 points it could take to get fourth place. Ridiculous amount. Liverpool looking like they're going to get 100 points. Wolves in the final have been fantastic. Thanks everyone for watching. It's going to be big tomorrow. I will speak to you all tomorrow. 8 o'clock tonight on the United Stand. Really enjoyed that stream. I'm knackered after it. And uh, speak to you soon.